Hello guys, thank you so much for joining me today for our full body Pilates power sculpt session. You can expect a lot of powerful movements in this session. So as always, listen to your body, push where you wanna push, pull back where it feels like you need to. So we're gonna get started straight away on the mat, just you and the mat today, no equipment needed. So come and join me in your tabletop position. Let's jump straight into it. Go ahead and drop the belly open the chest, inhale. Exhale, curve through that spine. We're just going to quickly take a little warm up. So start to take some circles forward and around, warming up through those wrists. You're going to be on them a lot today. So just warm up through those joints, circle back, shake through the hips. Just take any movement here that your body feels like it needs today. So maybe it's a cat cow, maybe it's more of an exaggerated movement. Really zone in, start to listen to what you need. That's it. Inhale. Uh, exhale it out. Okay. Are we ready to get started? Let's find that neutral position. We're going to jump straight into it today. So hands are underneath the shoulders, knees are underneath the hips. From here, you're going to stretch that right leg long across the mat. You're going to lift that leg up, squeeze the glute. You're going to lower the leg down. You're going to tuck the toes nice and straight through that leg. You're going to lift the body up. You're going to pull left knee to chest. Try and get that left knee to the chin. That's it. Lower down, reset, untuck that back toe, leg lift, lower, tuck the toe, lift that leg, lower. That's it. So we're working into the glutes, working the core, working the shoulders, full body, switching on. That's it. Nice and slow. Press. Exhale on the way up. Inhale to the lower down. That's it. You've got it. Lift and lower. Okay, let's start to slow down that leg lift. Really squeeze at the top. Lower it down, pull knee to chest. That's it, you've got it. Press, tap, and lift. Beautiful. Make it nice and hot pretty quick here. That's it, you've got it. Another five. Last four. Squeeze, pull it closer into the chest. Pull it towards the chin for three. Squeeze. Last two. Rounding through those shoulders as you come up. One more here, lift. Lower, pull knee to the chest, lift and hold. Start to bring the knee towards the face. Press it in, hold it here, pressing out through those shoulders for five, four, last three, two, one. Drop that knee down towards the mat, lift that back right leg, hold it there for me. You're gonna tuck the left toes under this time, come and hover off the mat. So you're coming into a one leg tabletop. Tap the knee, lift, tap. Lift, keep that right leg straight out behind you. That's it, you've got it for another five. Last four, pull belly back, button back for three, two. Last one, hold it there for me. Squeeze everything in, five, four. Last three, two, one. Press back into a three-legged dog. That's it, that right leg shoots up towards the sky. Press out through those shoulders. From here, keep that right toe pointed, lower towards the mat, lift towards the sky. Lower and lift, lower and press. That's it, working through that right glute, you've got it. You're here for another six, squeeze at the top. Last five, beautiful, you've got it. Press through the shoulders for four, another three. That's it, beautiful, give me two. Give me one, hold it at the top, pull that knee into the chest, hold it here for me for five, four, squeeze higher, three, two, one, step that leg through, beautiful, that's it. Inhale, exhale, sink those hips down, rock forward and back here. Beautiful, nice little warm up. Plant that left hand on the mat, right hand reaches up towards the sky, stretch out through that side body, inhale. Exhale, plant that hand back down. From here, you're gonna rise those hands up towards the sky, inhale. Exhale, sink into those hips. From here, we're going to come into a little lunging series. Back leg comes in to meet the top. You shoot that leg back, arms come back behind you, tricep press. Lift forward, press back, squeeze those triceps. So you're lunging and tricep pressing. Lower, press. Put that weight into the right heel. That's it, you've got it. Lift, lower. Squeeze the glute, press up towards the sky. Beautiful. If you need to stop the arms, just focus on the leg. You can bring the hands to the chest. Beautiful, keep a bend through this right knee the whole time. That's it, you've got it, press and back. 
press forward, shoot it back. You're here for another five. That's it, nice quick class today. Last four. Can you drop that back knee lower for three? Last two. On this next one, hold it down. That's it. Press those triceps back. Squeeze those hands together. You're here for five, four, last three, two, one. Hold those arms up high. Pulse into that front knee. You've got it. Whew. There's that burn. Pulse into it for six, five, last four, three, two, one, lower those hands down towards the mat. Step back, right leg, come into your plank. Rocking forward and back here in your plank for 10. That's it, nice and strong through those arms. Nine, last eight, slight tuck of the tailbone here for seven, six, last five. You've got it, squeeze the core for three, two, one. Drop those knees wide, sit back into your child's pose. Beautiful, inhale. Exhale, drop the forehead down towards the mat. Take a second here. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. Okay. Feeling nice and warm here, I hope. You're going to rip yourself forward. Find your tabletop position here again. Neutral spine here. You're going to take that left leg back behind you. Square off those hips. Go ahead and lift that left leg. It lowers down towards the mat, tuck that toe, pull that right leg into the chest this time. Try and reach towards the chin, lower it down, reset, lift. Okay, here we go. So you know what you're doing on this side now, so you should feel a little bit more confident with the movements. So you can really flow through them. Let's start drawing into that form. So pressing out of the shoulders, exhaling as you squeeze up. That's it, gently lower that knee, press back. Really squeeze through that glute as you lift that leg. Feel each part of the movement here. We don't want to rush through anything. That's it, lift, lower, shoot that leg back. Nice, quick, effective power class today. Really working all parts of the body. Press and lower. That's it, you've got it. Stronger than you think. Lift and lower, squeeze. Press back, beautiful. You are here for another four. Squeeze for three. Really round through those shoulders as you pull that leg up. Last two, that's it. Stay nice and focused here. You have one more, lift, lower. Pull that leg in this time, you're gonna pulse it up. Hold and pulse. Bring that knee in towards the face, further in. You've got it, can you touch that chin? You're here for four, three, last two, one. Drop that leg down towards the mat. This time you're gonna lift leg, leg nice and long behind you. Press out of those shoulders, tuck the right toes. That's it, inhale, exhale, lift up. You are here. You're gonna tap the mat and lift. Inhale, tap. Exhale to lift, you keep that leg, le left leg. <laughs> I can't speak, I'm focusing. Keep that left leg nice and strong behind you. You're here for five. Yes, you can for four. Last three, pull belly button back towards the spine for two. Last one, hold it there for me. Hold and squeeze. Everything is working strong through the entire body. You are here for five, four, <laughs> yes, you can. Three, two, one, find that down dog, press into those hips. So you've got it from here. Lower that left leg, shoot it up towards the sky, squeeze that glute. That's it, take it further away from you, really lengthen through those toes. You have got it. You are so strong, so proud of yourself here for getting through this. You're here for another six. That's it, five. Squeeze and breathe for four. Last three, I know it's burning. Four, two, just one more here. Lift that leg, pull the knee to the chest, hold it here for five. Yes, we can, four, three, lift higher, three, two, one. Stepping forward here on your mat, just frame that front leg, rock forward and back. That's it, just opening up into that hip. Little breather here, inhale. Exhale, plant that right hand down, open left hand up towards the sky. Take that beautiful opening through the chest, little breather here. Inhale, 
and exhale it out. Beautiful. From here, go ahead and lift, lift those arms up long. Inhale, exhale, sink into those hips. From here, you're gonna bring right leg to meet the left leg, keeping a bend through this left knee the entire time, weights going through the heel. You're gonna step left, step right leg back, sorry, step back, triceps press back with you. You come back to center, lift the arms, step back, press those triceps. That's it, you've got it. Again, if you need to just work through the leg, take those hands to the chest. That's it, squeeze, lift, inhale back, exhale to press to center. Really squeeze through those triceps. Can you sink further into that right leg for me? That's it, you've got it. You're just here for six. Press, find your balance for five. That's it. Last four, squeeze those triceps. Try and bring those hands together for three. Beautiful. Two, smile through that pain. One, hold it down here. Press those triceps back. Dip that back leg lower for me. Yes, we can. We're here for six, five, last four, three, two, one. Hold those arms nice and strong. Pulse into that front leg. Oh my gosh, there's that burn into that quad. There we go. We're here for six, five, last four, three. Yes, you can too. One, drop those hands. Woo, take that release, find your plank. Woo, inhale, exhale. You know it's a strong class when a plank is a break. <laughs> plank comes as a relief. Okay, are you ready from your plank position? Take an inhale, exhale it out. Reset yourself. Okay, you beautiful people. Let's finish strong together. Here's your finisher. We're gonna work the entire body. So you come with me or you hold your high plank while you listen. From here, you're gonna shoot right leg up towards the sky, lower it down, keeping those hips squared. Lift the left leg, lower it down, roll over to the right, find your side plank, lift out of that oblique. Come back to center, lower those legs, tuck the elbows into the ribs, lower down tricep press. Exhale, lifts you up, tuck those toes, find your plank, roll over to the left side plank, lift through the oblique. Come with me, center plank, right leg lifts, it lowers, left leg lifts and lowers. You roll over to the right, you lift. You come back to center, drop those knees if you need to, find your tricep press up, exhale, lifts you up, tuck the toes, find your plank, roll to the left. That's your routine, come with me. You've got it. We're here, beautiful. Keep your form, plug that belly button to the spine, really zone in here. Last little bit of work. You've got it, take it nice and slow. Don't need to rush it. Feel the movement, really lift through that waist. You've got it working shoulders, working glutes, working core, working absolutely everything keeping you nice and strong this is where you're going to see the changes so come with me and let's push for this last little bit you've got it lift reach we're almost there are we ready let's do two more lift and lower voice is starting to shake good sign means we're working nice and hard center drop those knees inhale drop the chest exhale lift Find plank, roll to the left, come back to center last time. I don't know if that was two or one, so you're doing another round. <laughs> That's it, lift. Come back to center, drop, press. Oh my gosh, we are so strong, should be super proud. Find center. That's it, hold. Put those legs a little wider if you need to. Shoulder taps to finish for 10, nine. Try and keep those hips squared for eight. Seven, plug that belly button for six. Last five, four, three, two, one. Drop that chest, or rather drop the legs, open the chest, inhale. Exhale, press back, find your wide leg child's pose. Inhale, exhale, walk those hands further forward. Take a little sway side to side here if you need to. Oh, there we go. We are all done. Strong Pilates. Stay with me here for a little stretch. 
really important to cool down, stretch out the body. On the inhale, come forward, find your tabletop, tuck those toes, press back, find your downward dog. I promise you we're not coming into those leg lifts. Just walk out through the heels here, take what feels good, stretch out through those hamstrings, that's it, you've got it, stretch. You can take little twists here with the waist if it feels good. Inhale, exhale, plant those heels as far down as you can. Don't need to be touching the mat. Ripple forward plank. Step that right leg forward, come into your lizard pose. You can stay high if you'd like, or you can drop that back leg, untuck the toe. Inhale, sink that hip down. From here, just take your hand to your temple. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, tap down to your elbow. Inhale, reach. Just really getting into those hip flexors, that's it. Mobilizing the spine, little twist through the body. That's it, you've got it lift, lower. Just hold it open here, really twist your side body. Can you stretch that hand behind you? Will this back toe lift to meet you for that quad stretch? If it doesn't, no worries. Inhale. Exhale, twist a little further back. We are all done with today's workout. Let's do that opposite side. Tuck that toe, lift the front leg back and set the left leg forward this time. Sink into the hip, drop that bottom leg if it feels good, untuck that toe. Just sink into the hips here. Go ahead and bring that left hand up to the temple. Reach down towards the right elbow. Open up, twisting through the spine. Find that opening in the spine, the chest. Really working into those hip flexors. You've got it reach and open. Can you twist further to the back of the room? You've got it and open. Okay. Let's do another three here. It feels so good. Last two. Really opening and twisting further if you can. One more. Open. Hold it here. Really open through the chest. Twist through the spine. Reach that hand behind you if you can. Lift that back leg to meet you. Inhale. Exhale draws you in here. Really find that quad stretch. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale it out, beautiful, lower that leg. Tuck the toe under, just bring that right leg to meet the left at the top. Can you find your deep yogi squat here? You need to be a bit higher you can be, you can sit on a block or a cushion if you like. Open up those hips, open the knees. You can take a little twist with the feet here if it feels good. And then nice and slowly just sit yourself down onto the mat in a cross-legged position. Let's do a couple closing breaths together. Go ahead and inhale, reach those hands up overhead, gazing towards the sky. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, reach towards the sky, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, release. On this next one, close down the eyes. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, palms down towards heart center. Keep those eyes closed here. Just take a second to come back into your body. Come back to that nice, calm breath. Thank yourself today for moving on the mat. Thank you so much for joining me. One last breath together, inhale. And exhale it out through the mouth, nice clearing breath. Shake out through the body, roll those shoulders down and back. You are all finished. You should be super proud of yourself for taking a challenging class. I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you again soon.